sir. K, what the freak? NY Drill, what rappers are locked up for part one? Yo, shout out, bro. And nothing really more to say. He made W videos. You had us. You haven't seen his channel. What are you doing? Go sub up, like, comment, share. Do all what you do to me. Do to him. Pause. <laughs> now, let's get into the shit. Yo, what's good, guys? This video is about yes, what sir, drill yes, rappers sir. are locked for. Most of the stuff in this video takes place in New York City, so let's get into it. For the first rapper, we got PJ Glizzy. PJ yes, Glizzy. Sir. Free PJ, man. That's crazy. Was arrested in November of 2022 for second degree murder in Harlem. He allegedly murdered a two woo member named Matthew Sumter, also known as Matt Sav, on a song with that's his crazy. brother and beloved. You know, that's crazy, bro. I never fucking knew. Uh, I knew that situation happened, right? And I never knew that was Matt Sav. They used to always diss that. That was the person who ended up passing away. I always thought Matt Sav, I know it's Matt Sav and, um, Who's the other dude? Um, you mean the you know one who got you know who's which one is that? The one you know who got you know stabbed at school by you know that um word. I always thought that was the same person, just a different name. And I'm like, what the fuck they call bro like different 20, 30, 20, 30 different names? Did not know that was that two woo nigga. Yo, rest in peace, bro. Rest in peace, dog. He predicts the future. In the song, he said, I might just slide to his block with a, a dirt, dirt bike, bike, and the police are claiming that PJ Glizzy did the hit on a dirt bike, meaning if the police are right, PJ Glizzy predicted the future and is the Bronx first precognitioner drill rapper. But That's anyways, crazy. for the next one, we got a rapper known as Nazi BK. Nazi BK was recently locked up for a YouTube prank, but he is now being held for second degree. I ain't never seen a YouTube get locked. A nigga get locked up for a YouTube prank go so far left. How the fuck you get locked up for a YouTube prank and now you over here facing a whole bunch of other charges? Great. Murder. Allegedly, Nazi BK murdered a 22-year-old man known as Idressa Saibi. According to the police, he shot the man in Times Square, one of the world's most visited tourist attractions. Nazi BK and the man were in an argument, which then escalated to the man getting shot in the right side of his chest. For the next rapper, we got another person from Courtland named CJ Goon who is locked up for attempted murder. He was arrested on August 26, 2022 for allegedly flocking at the Ops. There is a video of him where he appears to duck while shooting. It's unclear if he hit anyone or who the people he was shooting at. Anyways, the next rapper is someone known as B. Goon who Free is another Bida. member from Courtland. Every rapper I have done so far God, in this video- damn, man. These, these niggas, really, niggas really do say rap what they say as B. Goon, who is another man, member from Courtland. Every rapper I have done so far in this video is from the block Courtland, where Shai yeah, K yeah. and B. Love are from. Not a lot of people know this, but Nazi BK is also from Courtland yeah. and can be seen in the song Shoot or Get Shot by Shai K, PJ Glizzy, and B. Goon. But anyways, B. Goon was locked for attempted murder and is being held in Rikers Island, more specifically the EMTC housing facility. For the next rapper, we got oh, K-Flock, who was we locked in flock. Rikers for shooting a man in Harlem, but has been sent to the feds for a RICO case. The RICO That's case crazy. charges includes murder, assault with a deadly weapon, and conspiracy, and will face a mandatory life in prison sentence if convicted on all charges. It's sad to see K-Flock at only 19 having to go out like this. He yeah. paved a way for a lot of Bronx drill oh, rappers yeah. and made it the farthest in Bronx drill with him being the only drill Bronx rapper reaching 60 million views on a drill song. But let let it be known that the feds have a 98% conviction rate, meaning nine times out of. That's why I leave. I put out everything I leave just thinking of like, I'm like, damn, man. I'm about to say it, but I ain't going to say it. At least bro said it. 98% chance. 98% chance. So we got to hope on that little small 2% chance somehow bro get, you know, work. But let it be known that the feds have a 98% conviction rate, meaning nine times out of 10, the feds will pack up K-Flock. Yeah. For the last rapper, we got D-Thing. D-Thing is locked for second degree possession of a weapon. He's also locked up for conspiracy because our PT had a RICO case picking up tons of our PT members. But anyways, that's it for today. Let me know in the comments if you like the text-to-speech voice and also give me ideas for videos I should do. Make sure you join my Discord and follow my IG. I fought with this voice, but I don't know. I feel like you should, like you should use a different voice. Shout out Kenneth. Kenneth. I like this voice. Yeah. Yes, sir. 
What's my boy K Star getting paid? Hey yo, shout out K what the freak. I went for the day. I for the day I make my first dollar off YouTube, but it's over for y'all. Nigga, I'm gonna be posting 50, 30 videos a day, but I'm gonna be spamming videos. Nah, I'm playing around, but uh y'all show us love. Do what y'all do. Man, man, man. This situation right here with K Flock is a sad situation because it's like one of the movies. You know the ending. You know how it's going to go. 9 out of 10, you know how it will end. But you just got to hope that it don't end like that. But, you know, or free all of them, even at the situation they usually locked up for is a crazy situation. But, you know, show some love. Do what y'all do. More videos come soon. You keep watching because I'm dropping your ASAP. You ain't right. You ain't right. You left in the dust. Or I know all of these. I just wanted to really, you know, this nigga post it. And nigga, just because I know it don't mean I'm not going to tune in. Come on now, you know that.